Hello, my friends, and welcome to my segment of Heather Renee's Spring Into Color Women's Collaboration. I will list all the video channels and links to the other videos in the description box below. So I'm going to be doing a swipe today with these lovely spring colors. I am using Artist Loft Ready Mix Pouring Paints, which I have extended with a glue and flow trial mix. I will detail it down below, but I love experimenting with these paints I have over, I don't know, probably 70 videos with them, doing all sorts of things with them, and I really enjoy a swipe when I've extended them. So I've got um, Magenta Deep, Magenta Deep with White, Orange with White, Deep Yellow with White, Sap Green with White, Cerulean Blue, maybe with white, can't remember, and uh, violet with white and without white. So I think it's a quite a lovely uh, palette. I'm going to lay down a base coat of white and then we'll add some color and I'll be right back. Okay, my white base coat is down and let's get to it. I think I'm gonna do a swath of these colors and then a separate swath of these other colors, and then I may even add some lines to it after I swipe. We shall see. So here we go. I received some Australian Floetrol from one of my subscribers, what a wonderful gift, Maria. Thank you again, Maria. And I tried it yesterday for the first time, so I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it with these um, Artist Loft paints and see how how it works, how or if, I don't know what to expect. I'd be thrilled if it does. I've done a lot of swipes with um, this Artist Loft and adding a little silicone to the Artist Loft and you get nice cells that way too, but it would be fun to not use silicone. I think before I add my, well, or should I? Yeah, I'll go ahead and add the other colors now. This is a total experiment, my friends. I've never tried the um, Floetrol, Australian Floetrol with this mix before. But if you're watching this video, I guess it worked. <laughs> okay. So I mixed up three tablespoons, or three parts rather, of um, Australian Floetrol and one part of white paint. I couldn't find my Amsterdam, so I just used Liquitex and it seemed to work on yesterday's pour, yesterday's swipe with the black. So hopefully it will work with this. Let us see, I'm gonna just put down, well, you know what, I'll do this instead. I have this large spatula that came with my uh, Cake Turner, which a subscriber also gifted me. That I have very generous subscribers. I don't know how much of this I should put on. So I have a medium amount. It's not terribly thick. And here we go. Woohoo! Start in the purple here. Hey, where are the cells? There are, oh, there they are. Oh, isn't that pretty? Whoa! Oh my goodness! That is pretty. Maybe I wasn't pressing down hard enough in the uh, Lavender. Oh, this is so pretty on here. I, I don't want to waste it. I think I'm just, I'm going to run it over here in this negative space. Okay. 
just like that. Okay, and I will be tilting, of course. Oh my gosh, it's pretty. All right. Wipe that off. I am thrilled that it works with these paints. And you don't have to have Amsterdam, apparently. Liquitex works fine, too. Okay, and here we go. Oop, oh, well. Whoa, <laughs> look at that, it's so pretty on the, on the thingy. I'm not sure how I feel about that. I'm, gonna, I'm not gonna do anything else. Okay, I'm gonna quickly, uh, I'll let that sit for a second here while I put my gloves on, and then we'll do some tilting. I'm going to bring you in now before I tilt to show you how pretty those cells are looking. Isn't that lovely? I'm not sure about this down here, but that may get tilted off. All right. Time to tilt. I'm going to have to go this way to... Make that part reach the edge. Slow and steady is the key. I'll lose all my violet there. I think I'll come back this way. Yeah, that little addition I did has got to go. Most of it anyway. Oh my gosh, I, I don't know that I want to add any more lines. I rather like the simplicity of this. Could I possibly be done already? <laughs> I wonder if I want to add anything else. I, I, I'm into minimalism lately, and uh, I think I'm going to stop. I'm, I'm pleased with the way it, it looks. Let me bring you in for a closer look, my friends. I don't know that it's very plain, but look at look at that, how this, the Floetrol, the Australian Floetrol worked with this paint. Okay, I gotta add some more. This is a little too minimal, even for me, and I have time yet, so. <laughs> 
Let me do a little more. Uh, what shall I do? And where? Maybe I'll add some of the, this up here and that down there. Maybe just some of the um, violets since I didn't really get to. Uh... And let me do this. Or maybe I'll do my my lines. Okay, never mind. I'm sorry. I'm changing plans. I'm just going to do some lines like this instead of another swipe. Because I love lines. Yeah, that's fun. It's, it's still minimal and it dresses it up a bit. Kind of my signature, I think, lines. And now I'll add some of the pink ones and maybe I'll overlap this pale area there. Some of the warmer tones over here. I have plenty of paint left. I'll be doing some more experimentation for sure. There we go. It's kind of like a party. Party streamers. <laughs> I'm stopping now. Okay, my friends. This was great fun for me. I hope you enjoyed it too. Thanks for watching, and now let's head over to Kathy Nordland's channel to see her part of this collaboration.